it, it's it's two thousand dollars to enter your program, right? Yes, sir. And you also mm -hmm. own a store that we own together, right? Now, oh, okay. The two thousand. So it's like a partnership, right? It's, it's mm -hmm. a partnership. That's why it's called e-commerce partners dot um dot um dot online. Somebody's okay. gonna five hundred dollars, man. Hey, you might go find the same thing on eBay. Good luck, bro. <laughs> 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 like like I told you, the programs like this usually cost thirty five thousand dollars. This is the pilot program. Right. Um. I want to make sure that we have everything in order, right? We can't mm -hmm. go out there charging $35,000. After this group, more than likely, we'll increase the price. And the whole idea is we want to create sort of like an incubator of brands, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So you're responsible for the ad spend for your store, right? Because it's your right. store. But if you, if you take $5,000, and you know this because you do online marketing, mm -hmm. and you try to spend $5,000 on Facebook ads, and you give someone who's really experienced at Facebook ads, Five thousand dollars to sell the same product, they might sell five times more what you would sell. Right, right, right. It's 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 that much of an art, right? Yes. So, yes. So we have people that are really experienced, right, managing right. that ad spend, and right. we also use influencers and other strategies. And I'm not, I don't care to talk about right now to make right. sure the stores are successful because we have a stake in it as well. You know what I'm saying? So right. it's and, not, and and I'm and I'm gonna say this. Here's the good thing about that, guys. I, I I'll say this. Well, two things. The first thing I'll say is, is that one of the biggest problems, I had this conversation with someone about a week ago. One of the biggest problems, and, and I'm, I'm going to call out, because I know my people, right? I only can call out my people, right? I know my people. Uh, one of our biggest issues is that we think that when we start a business, that people are just supposed to come and buy, right? No, it, doesn't, doesn't it doesn't work that way. Right. We have to understand the importance of marketing, right? Marketing is by far the best investment you can do. Period. Probably. Right. I'm not even saying for a bit, just period. Like the, the return on marketing is ridiculous, right? Did, did we pin the site? Yes, yeah, pin. Yeah, it's pinned at the top. Commerce partners that are online. Yeah. So it's important, like you said, whether you're selling digital products, physical part products, services, anything, is to be able to effectively market and use um, all of the data that Zuckerberg and everybody else is collecting, right? And that's sure. the key. That's the key, right? So right. that's the first thing uh, when you said that part, that part alone is worth more than the $2,000 right there because I own a marketing company. So <laughs> I'm telling you right now, for you to even use my marketing company, you got to come in with $3,500 right off rip, you right. know? Right. So, and that's so, so a, that's a monthly return. Gets you into the program, right? Mm -hmm. You have access to eight weeks of training. We do live, weekly live calls, right? They're always mm -hmm. recorded in case you miss them. Um, but the whole idea is we want to, I want to empower people, um, including myself. I, I want to be empowered with the knowledge from people that have actually earned seven figures on Shopify. You know what I mean? Right. I, I don't right. want to do the guesswork. I don't want to keep watching hours of YouTube videos and, and just making mistakes after mistakes and then tapping out you know what i mean right I'd rather hand off the keys and play my position which is okay I, i'm responsible for the money for the ads and you guys manage it for me that's a true partnership you know right it's, it's, right. it's a win-win for everyone and so right. as as someone was managing this program my responsibility is to make sure that the stores are profitable your responsibility mm -hmm. is to make sure that you're getting informed right and you know playing your position which is you are spending the money for the ads now here's the cool part about it if we get the stores in a point where they have momentum, you know, like mm -hmm. you said, don't eat the seeds. When we're reinvesting the profits back into ad spend, mm -hmm. as we scale, our costs on the ads become cheaper, right? Right. Our customer right. acquisition costs become cheaper. People start coming back to our store. We have repeat customers. We have an email list. We can sell right. the business for a multiple of our monthly profit, right? That's why mm. it's digital real estate because if you have a Shopify store right now that's making six thousand dollars a month. That means you have a hundred and eighty thousand dollar asset. And right. We all do real estate. A lot of us do real estate here, right? You can't right. buy a physical real estate property by now for two hundred thousand dollars and make six thousand right. dollars a month. But right. you could create a website that makes you six thousand dollars a month and take the profits from that and go buy a piece of property. Right. So right. We gotta re we gotta kind of like rethink these things, and these things are very yeah. important because you can you can take a loan against your real estate your your, your online store. Shopify right. actually fund you. Mm. So they look at mm. how they have all the data on all your sales 
And they'll tell mm -hmm. you, listen, we have $10,000 available to you anytime you need it. Mm. They don't wow. take credit or anything. It's all based off your revenue. It's revenue-based financing. Ah, and you yes, pay them yes. from your daily sales. Right, so, right. Owning an online store is like building property with your own hands, but with your brains instead, right? Right. <laughs> with your marketing yeah. skills. The more, you, the more you sell, the more of a database you have, the more emails you're collecting, the more the value it is. And there, there are people out there that, that, that are interested in buying your store and taking it to a higher level. Right. Now you're talking so, exit strategy. So you could start out owning multiple stores if you can handle it. Right. The whole idea is you want to, you don't want to be the type of person that goes, oh, I, I, you know, I have to force what I love. You got to go with what people want. So the mindset is very important. And right. right now we're going into the fourth quarter of what's the most unique year in our lives. You see what I'm saying? Everyone right. knows this. Everyone has heard about Black Fridays, Cyber Mondays. The numbers that come out of those holidays are real. The right. nominal retail holidays, but there's no more retail stores. Guess where all the right. money's gonna go? Online. 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 Yeah. Well, you gonna hear Online. people making a hundred grand, fifty grand. You're not making a dollar. Because Gotta get you in where you fit in. Position. You know what I'm saying? Gotta get in where you fit in. Yeah. So that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to elevate our people, man. You know, knowledge is power, and there's no point in me knowing this information and and not sharing it. And at the right. same time, I'm not here to talk all day. I'm looking for partners. Fifty. 50. Right. You know, right. equity, you know what I mean? Equity in all of my deals, man. I'm, I'm a pro. I hear you. Tip, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, <laughs> I hear like, you. I, you know, I have knowledge to bring to the table. I, you know, I know how to, you know, I build brands. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what right. we do here. We're, we're trying to look for people that are like-minded. We're building the tribal people that want to monetize the, the transfer of wealth going on right now. Right? Right. The biggest family, the richest family in the world is the Waltons, you know, the, the Walmart family. They, right. They're very big in e-commerce. The richest man in the world is Jeff Bezos. Amazon right. is the biggest e-commerce site, right? Yeah. So yeah. if you just get sprinkles of those trillions, right? You just get yours, you know? Right. Right. It, 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 right. It's, it's worth something, right? Right. There's a store right now that does sixty-five hundred dollars a month selling fifty-dollar price range jewelry, and they're asking one hundred seventy-five thousand dollars for to buy it, to sell, to buy it. Excuse me. And think about that. Mm -hmm. One hundred twenty-five thousand dollars right now. Right. Would you rather buy if you if, if you don't understand how to do digital marketing or Facebook marketing? If you mm -hmm. were to buy that store, you can't maintain that sixty-five hundred. Right. It's right. It's gonna go like this. Right. Right. But if you can find someone who understands marketing, or if you learn right. marketing, right, that becomes a real revenue, recurring revenue stream. Yeah. You see yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah. people got to really look into digital real estate, man. Just tap in with me, man. I'm not hard to find. I'm, you know, I'm, uh, I'm a cool guy. You know what I mean? As long as you're right. not calling me to waste my time, I'll, I'll, I'll holler back. <laughs> hey, that, hey, listen, man. So let me say this. What's up? Got Wall Street trap in the house. What's good, family? Um, uh, so I think, I think, I don't know if a lot of, if, it, if people caught it all, like you just basically explained how you get into something, right? You create, uh, you get into this business that's that's digital. So first, the first question is, I can do that business from anywhere. I can be in LA. Business from anywhere. Listen, yesterday there was mm -hmm. a brother that hit me up from a country I never heard of, and I thought I was smart. Mm -hmm. You ever heard of Saint Estanisius? Nah. <laughs> Thirty-five hundred people, bro. It's a Dutch territory. He's starting. He's joining the program. He's in wow. an island with thirty-five hundred people, and he can have a Shopify store. Wow. So wow. that's everyone else's excuse. Yeah. Right? People yeah. Got, you know what I'm saying? Like at the end of the day, right? Cool. You could if you don't want to play the game of Shopify, God bless you. But I just right. urge you to look into what's going on around you right now. Do you know that right. there was an Instagram page called Daquan? Oh, I heard. Like Warner Brothers for 85 million. 85 million, yeah, I heard. No, I heard. we laugh about it. It's not funny, yeah. man. It's, it's a meme funny, page. Bro. That's serious. That personal, because you know yeah. why, why can't we do something like that? Me, you, you right. drop for all of us. Right. You gotta You're be right. deliberate about that. You gotta play that game. What's yeah. our digital real estate portfolio looking like? Indeed. Individually and collectively as a people. Are we gonna miss out on this opportunity too? Right? Are we gonna mm. you know, are we are we in here for the dopamine of the dollars, man? Mm. It's mm. time for us to wake up, you feel me? Yeah. Right? So I yeah. feel like you know yeah. they don't teach us e commerce in school. Nah, but well, they don't teach nah. white people e-commerce in school either. 
You got to get it. So it's a you got to get out here and get it. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. The internet don't discriminate, bro. There's a That's brother the in my program who's an instructor. His name is Go mm -hmm. Get Go Get a 303. Cool dude from Colorado. He did 11 and a half years in the pen. Last mm. December, he did $200,000 in the Shopify store. The numbers mm. are the age. You can't make them up. So this type of information is very life-changing. It's very powerful. This ain't no yeah. juke. This ain't no hustle. This is something that right. you don't have to go through us. You can right. go find out for yourself what they're charging people to learn stuff like this. Just look up Shopify Automation, Amazon FBA Automation. They're charging $25,000 mm. and they're not telling them the game. Wow. You know, so I feel like what's the point of hiding that information? You know what I mean? Right. There are people Let out me... here that have the resources to be partners with us and we right. have the resources to turn that partnership into a win-win situation. So that's what I'm... I, I, I'm here to speak about, but e-commerce in itself, it, it's evolving. It's changing every day. Like people are making right. money from selling products while they're on vacation. People are selling yeah. digital products. You know, th that's a form of e-commerce. You know, right. you, I, you know. You told me how much you make from your course. I'm not going to say it here, but you know, it's you think about if you don't you think about if you didn't think about that play. Right, right. Um, how much right. less of your network you would have right now from a right. digital product? You know what I'm saying? Right, right, true. True. Compare True. that to how um, I'll, I'll, I'll much longer it'll take you to acquire that, that amount of equity in, oh, real, in real estate. estate. Oh, yeah. It, yeah. It doesn't That's compare. That's yeah. real estate, bro. Yeah. 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 You know, and, and somebody called me and said, oh, another brother is already talking about digital real estate. I'm like, look, we need to start being about this old one brother's talking about this, the other brother. I ain't stealing shit. Digital real estate is a common term, bro. Right, this ain't right. Nothing to do. This is no person. This is no dicks. Nobody. We can't have right. that mindset that oh, I'm a thought leader and I'm the only one that's supposed to give the information to people. I'm the like only trucking. One that's supposed to talk about digital real estate. I'm the only yeah, one like that's trucking. To talk about trucking. Right, that's a right. Mindset. I check that. Yeah, and I rebuild yeah. that, bro. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah, yeah. We're supposed yeah. to be. We're supposed to come together and brainstorm and mastermind. Right. Because that's right. how it's done. Right. If anything else is just ego and bullshit, and get the fuck out of here with that. And who I'm there you go. knows who the fuck they are. Right, right. There you go. Like, don't come at me on some. I'm stealing somebody's shit. I was here when that boy was in diapers, bro. I rode with Nick. Real shit. Oh, I know. I know. <laughs> I already. I already know. Hey, I, I already know. That, bro. Hey, let. So let me ask you this. Um. If I let's say I did this, like how much how much time? Because that's a common question. Like how much time would it require me? Like if I if I was working a regular job, I worked a nine to five, and I joined your program, is it you know was something I could do after work on the weekend? What's you know what 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 time requirement does it require? Program right? It's a, it's mm -hmm. a done for you approach, right? So okay. We actually use this as a way for you to learn the game. While okay. It's a learn and earn approach. You know, okay. a lot of people sell courses, right? And people watch right. courses and fall asleep while watching them. I bought so many courses I ain't watching them. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> true. So true. You know what I'm saying? So what we're trying to create is a situation where, you know, you have an opportunity. It's a choice to learn and earn or learn or earn. Let me let me explain. Mm. You okay. come in the program just to learn, not even have a store. You don't, you don't have to do a partnership with us. You just want access okay. to the knowledge and, and, and the instructors that we have. That's great. We have a program. We have, we have a price point for that. If you want to right. come in the program and partner up with us because you don't have the time to run a store or you don't have mm -hmm. the knowledge and you want to make money while you learn because you realize that you have the capability to do the ad spend, right? We recommend about $3,000 for the first month, $3,000 okay. for the second month because like right. you said, you have to build up that customer base. You have to warm up what we call the pixel, right? Right, you to, right. You have to test the ads before we scale them, right? Anyone right. tells you, you give them two thousand dollars and you're gonna make money. It's full of shit. You pay right. two thousand dollars for the enrollment into the program. Right. Where other right. people would have charged you thirty five thousand dollars for that. I want to set the right expectations. Right now, right. what you get with the two thousand dollars is an actual online business that we own together. We're in business mm -hmm. together. Our mm -hmm. role is to manage the business. Your role is to fund the marketing expenses. Okay. Right? And mm -hmm. our role is to turn that marketing expenses into a significant return in ad spend. Right. So hmm. you put three thousand dollars in the business. We might not see some profits in the first month, but we are gaining momentum and have right. data to retarget so that by the second month, when we double up in the ad spend. Right. Mm -hmm. we, we now start seeing some profit. 
And now right. we can reinvest, we reinvest the ad spend and, and we have an automated online business. Right. And if we can right. keep that consistent and keep tweaking it, which we do, right. you hands right. off. Right. right. But you right. also have access to the store. You know what I'm saying? You, you mm -hmm. have access to the store. You can actually um, look at the Shopify store. Anytime someone buys something, you get the notification, you get that. That's the type of okay. adrenaline rush we need. Okay. <laughs> Order. Right, <laughs> right, <laughs> right. Thumbs up, man. They put right. us with that, you know. We yeah, we'll, we, we don't care about we don't care about the likes. We want the dollar bag emoji. There we, there we go. There we go. There we go. You get those, right? You get the notifications. Mm -hmm. You can actually run reports in the store. You can see how much your store is earning. Right. You know, we can. You can always request. We're partners. You can set up a call and make suggestions on the store. But at the same time, you can build your own store and own it one hundred percent. Right. Okay. It's not an exclusive thing, but we have a store together because we're managing that one for you. And the whole idea right. is at some point, we can sell that store and split right. the gains. If we take okay. that store to a point where it's making $6,000 a month, I'll show you right now stores that make $6,000 a month selling for 150 grand. Mm. Wow. Wow. That's big. How that's, many people got $150,000 equity in their crib? Yeah, that's, that's, that's big. Real. That's big. That's, so that's big because you because right you can scale right. that and you can do multiple stores. Say so what? you can scale that and do multiple stores as well. You can have multiple stores. Right. You can have multiple right. stores. So so let me ask you, you said this. I'm not I'm just not comfortable giving two K to a random I don't trust. Listen, Mr. Prolific, you called me and told me you just came in the country four years ago and you don't have any money. And you told me you were gonna send me a wire. And then you said you weren't going to do the program. So why are you over here talking shit, little bro? Uh, somebody this you know. This prolific buff guy from Carolina. Didn't we talk? <laughs> I'm not a random guy. You the random guy. I'm a stand-up guy. Get the fuck out of here. Block that guy, Pocky, please. Yeah, he out of here. Don't worry. He out. So, so yeah, up, you man. you know you know we get him all the time. It's it's all right. You know that we get him. was in my DM the other day, man. That's a, that's the a sad part about it, man. Got me fucked up. Oh, that's. Man. I'm That's how it always man. is. I'm a businessman. Don't talk to me hey, like that. What, prolific. What you what you what you just posted with DJ Khaled? Say what? What you what's what's the quote you just posted with DJ Khaled? Khaled is a homie, man. Right. That's what I'm saying. What's the post you just posted about them trying to kick you? Oh yeah, man. They um they kick you when you they kick you when you're down, but they want to kick it when you're up. But he's on right. that level. He can never kick it with me. But but that's the thing. Just that's that's that's. that's that, that's 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 what people mindset be, you know. He talking about some random stranger you don't trust. I don't know you. Nobody knows you. I'm <laughs> Smiley. Ask about me, fool. <laughs> right, right. Hey, <laughs> listen, man. Started, man. Get the fuck out of here, man. Yeah. Get so more, let, man. let 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 listen. More. Let yeah. Let's get back more, to the man. people that that want to make some money. So I got I I'm got two more pocket, questions. Man. I'm not here for the trolls. Yeah, yeah. We don't have time for that. Listen. So I got I got two more questions. So I'm a person that wants to come in. You just yeah. broke. To, you just broke down to me the time or the, that it does or doesn't require. So, outside of the two thousand dollars for the program, just so I have an idea, what other upfront capital I need? And then the second question would be, what I know is based on how how much you scale, but sort of what's the average of what I'll make? Because most people try to figure out what it's going to cost me and what is what I'm gonna make. So, Good if question. you can give share so some light on that. So $2,000 gets you in the program, primarily mm -hmm. for the education. But we're going to throw in a store in that, right? Mm -hmm. So the store is included in that. Now, you can have the nicest store in the world. Without marketing, it's going to crash and burn. Yes. So, like I said earlier, we suggest you spend another $3,000 in marketing, right, mm -hmm. for the first month. Right? You might not see results from that. You might, right? Right. I'm trying to set right. the right expectations, right? Some people see results. Right. And we, because we have a stake in the store, we crack our brains around what's the best strategy to, to make the store work. We use SEO. We use not just Instagram ads. You know, if it's a, if it's a CPG product, we might do Snapchat. We do pay-per-click. Right. We do influencer marketing. We employ a bunch of, we're marketing experts collectively, right? So right, we employ right. different, um, different types of strategies to try to get the, you know, the store cracking, for lack of mm -hmm. better words, right? The right, second right. Month, now we have more data. We have a pile up of data that we can reach. That's how it works. We have an email yes. list that we built up with that initial ad spend, right? Right. So right. we expect to start seeing results after about 60 days to 90 days of owning the store. Your social mm -hmm. media following starts going up. Your credibility starts going up. Now you have a brand, right? 
Right, so right. At that point, at some point, we start seeing some return on the ad spend. So okay. it's a good question. What are you getting back? Look, there's a lady on my Instagram page who did, who spent, who, her name is um, Audrey, yeah. mogul entrepreneur. She said in November 2016, she had mm -hmm. no money. Right? She borrowed a thousand dollars from a friend and mm -hmm. a friend told her to figure it out. Single mom, right? Mm -hmm. Her bank account just got levied. She said she mm -hmm. did fifty thousand dollars in sales the next month. Wow. The videos wow. on my Instagram. You know wow. what I'm saying? And she shows a video where she started a store from zero dollars on March first, two thousand and twenty. And that store has done one point four million dollars in sales till today. Mm. Wow. Wow. So, I mean, just do the math. I mean, what are the returns on your investment? Everyone has different results, but different, if something right. like that is involved with managing your store, right. the probability and the odds that you'll be successful are higher than you try right. to figure it out yourself. Or like that Jack right. Castle was on the phone talking to me, on, on the line talking crazy. He had a Shopify store and he was crying about how he made no money. I mm. can use screenshots. People right. are silly, right. boy. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. So... So just to sort of be clear, most people you're going to need, I would just say, if you you, you need to come in with a minimum of seven to ten thousand dollars, right? But you, mm -hmm. you start out with two thousand dollars, right? 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 You, you, and it's not something where it's a bill; it's it's at your own pace. This is a suggested marketing spend. Now you right. might be someone who has a large Instagram following, and you know that the product that you want to sell, you know, ha resonates with your following. Your, your right. ad spend is not going to be the same as someone who's just trying to sell a product with that doesn't have an audience that has to build right. up an audience. So it's right. all case right. by case, and because we because we both have equity, we try to figure out the best way to get to the money. Right, that's the idea. Right. So, but at the bare minimum, you're going to. But if it's a fit for you, if you think it's something you want to look into, just reach out to me. The website is right. um, pinned on there, and my Instagram is also another way you can reach me. Yo. That's what's up, man. Listen. Um, I think it's a great opportunity. I'm, 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 hell, I might, I might join. <laughs> I might, you know me, I always well, looking for man. more you streams, well. hey, you know, I'm not streams gonna, of I'm not income. Back <laughs> hey, hey, that's what I'm like. Hey, another, another stream of income that that's not required for me that I can do. Listen, 2020 mobile and passive income. And now granted, I know there's people that have to do physical things, so I'm not, I know it's not for everybody, but we got to see that a lot of things are turning. Things are changing. For me, if it ain't mobile, if it ain't passive, I ain't doing it. That's just where I'm at, right? right. So Stop trading time for money. Yeah, 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 That's yeah. Out. Yeah, Stop yeah. Time for it, money. Yeah, this so. This is an automation of the, re, of the real way to have freedom, yo. You know, mm -hmm. this is mm -hmm. an automation. You got to make stuff. stuff or you got to get. You got to get involved with stuff that is automated. And you, right. just, you just, you just play like a video game. You control the sticks. You know, that's it. That's Probably it. Run away no more, man. It's twenty twenty. That's you gotta it. Go digital. <laughs> hey, listen. I'm, I'm telling you, man. Because and you have to have multiple streams. Like the, the beauty of this, what you're saying is, here we go again. Um, you know, this is not quit your job. This is an additional. Um, income stream, addition, addition, revenue stream, right? Exactly. So, therefore, this is this is an additional. Like you need multiple streams of income. We you cannot survive without multiple streams of income. It, like this, is, if, if anything, twenty twenty has shown us that. And who knows what's going to happen after the election? Right? We don't know. Right? right. So, you know, you you have to you have to be able to put yourself in a position to to do these things, whether it's truck, like I tell people, you don't got to do trucking. You don't got to do, you don't got to do digital. Rip, do something like do something, do man. something, Buy do something. Nine dollars, sell it for $200. Play the game, play the game, play the game. Play the game. Website that's, you know, do something, do something. Listen, there's, you know, it's, it's, get it's, it. I wouldn't say it's free money, but it's, it's, it's there's no startup cost to get involved with digital real estate. You well, know. what what people don't understand is, is, and you know, because me and you have been, I, I was, me and Sandy was laughing earlier because she was like, I was telling her about some people like, why am I where I'm at now and why I do? I said, because I've been an entrepreneur since I was 16 and I've ran several businesses. And so I'm at a different place in life, you know, where I'm at. And I said that to say, back in the day, the, the, to start a business, like, you come on, you you needed you needed Buku Capital. You needed, you know, you had to get 
you need to have to get physical places and you had to have the, the best credit. Like it was so many things that many had hurdles, to play. Yeah. Too many hurdles. Yeah. The, 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 the playing field has been leveled and even out. So this is, this is something we have to take advantage of. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, I, I really think so too. I think that, you know, there's a, there's a transfer of wealth going on right now. Right. Right. And, right. You know, we, we read the headlines, you know, we talked about the going for $85 million, but mm -hmm. we don't think about how we can reverse engineer these moves. Right. And, and you know, the way my brain works is I'm, well, I was the type of kid that used to break things apart to see how they work. And I think mm -hmm. I have sort of like a res recipe or, or system that I feel like has worked for other people. Right. But mm -hmm. the, you know, the barrier of entry was very high. Not too right. many people can afford $35,000 to get into a mastermind or into a right. program where, you know, they're, they're participating in, you know, Shopify, the Shopify economy, for lack of better words, right? So right. if you have a system where someone is managing it for you, that's not something you have to do. That's just something that is just another option, right? At the end of the day, you still have the option to do this by yourself. I'm not against right. it, but all I'm saying is, like, you know, it's knowledge, money, and time. And if you can right. save yourself some time, that means you get more money, right? Passive, you don't have passive knowledge, income. Don't waste your time. Right? right. So if you have access to people that have the knowledge, and I'm not, I'm not talking about myself. I know right. who. My, right. What I've done is I've gone out there and I've found people that are great at this, right? Mm -hmm. And I've convinced them to try to help people. And some of right. them want to do it willingly. Some of them took a lot more convincing. Some of them right. have to pay money for their time. And right. so we're, we're going to consistently bring the best thought leaders in the e-commerce space into this mastermind, into the program, so that right. we have access to the to that knowledge base, so that we can ask them questions, right? These are people right. that, right, um, you know, with their backs against the wall, against the wall, make millions with Shopify, right? Right. So right. It, it, when you have access to people like that, that's powerful, right? Of and, course. You know, when you align yourself with people like that, and you directly or indirectly go into business with people like that, you, you're aligning yourself with success, right? Yeah. So. It's not for the trolls. It's not for people that are doubting it. It's for people that are inquisitive and want to ask questions and, and really want to tap into another income stream. It's not for everybody. You know what I'm right. saying? Buddy over there was talking shit, man. He was talking about how, you know, he's still busting tables in South Carolina somewhere. And he was crying on my phone. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Right, right, I, I right. I looked at his Instagram. He was a big muscular nigga. And I was like, bro, you ain't, <laughs> you ain't got to bust tables, bro. You a king. <laughs> Talk shit. That's come on, man. We, we need yeah. to do better. Everything yeah. for everybody, but if you see someone trying to elevate all this, don't don't throw stones at me, bro. Somebody right. needs this information. If it's right, not, right. keep it pushing, man. That's it. You know, that's support it. what you like. Ignore what does you don't like. Right. You know, that's just good right. karma, little homie. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. Hey, listen, so that's what's up, man. Um, I got to go watch you know, the Laker game, man. Yeah, yeah, I know you got to go watch it, guys. So listen, guys, let, let me just recap really quick. Recap. If you're interested in uh, this e-commerce opportunity um, with Ish, um, his his website is pinned there. Go follow him. Um, like I said, don't take his word from it. Don't take my word. You know, look look at a few posts. Look, read the, read, look at the page. You know what I mean? Um but this is something that, again, what we have to realize is we have to find ways of making money that don't require all of our time, right? And this is how you build wealth. So, you know, check them out. Check out the program. There are only about eight slots left. They might be seven because I think I'm going to grab one. I, I'm going to be honest, not, not to go off a little bit, I'm thinking about grabbing one for somebody, I, like a family member, right? Why not? You know, you, yeah, you know, you got family who be asking you for things. It's so. a seed, man. It's a yeah, it's a seed. I, yeah, it's hey, a seed. I'm gonna plant this seed. Only the knowledge you can't put right. a price on that. Right, right. So you can't put a price on that. yeah, and, and it's another. What I look at it as, it's another uh, seed that's planted for our family. That now somebody in the family, a part of the group, as now as has as knowledge as well. on this that right. now can bring in revenue to the family. For sure. Right. That we can do this. So now we have I love trucking. The way you're we, thinking. I love the way oh, you're you know, thinking, bro. you already know, man. You know, I got real estate. I got trucking. I got marketing. I got somebody uh, needs to, know how to do the ads. Somebody, the yeah, the, the right. The so it's crucial, right? So that's that's what's up. Again, there are only eight slots. So hit them up if you're interested. 
Uh, it's only $2,000 to get in. The knowledge is worth well more than that, let alone the partnership. I like, I love that part that you're not going to be out here by yourself. You got somebody that's partnering with you. So you actually have vested interest in making sure it works because you don't, sure. the, the $2,000 ain't paying for nothing for you. That's, that's, I'm sure the people you got to pay, you, you, it, it's better for you to make sure the store is profitable because that's where you really going to get a chance to get paid. So this is an opportunity, guys. Check them out. Hit them up in the DM. Click the link in the bio or, or click the link to go to the website. It's pinned there. And, uh, you know, it, like he says, it may be for some, it may be for others. But um, this is an opportunity that only eight slots. I'm not sure when, if it will be open afterwards or how soon. So, you know, this is an opportunity to get into that. So that's, that's one way. Mo additional stream of income that can be passive for you. Uh, Y'all know they call me Pip, passive income pocky. That's why, because I'm that's if it ain't passive, if it ain't mobile, I don't want it. And again, I've always said this: the road to passive income is everything but passive. So don't think you know you still have to do what you have to do to get it there. Yeah, yeah. Because some people hear passive income and they think, oh, I don't do nothing. No, you're probably looking for a portfolio income, which is you put your money in the bank and a savings account and get zero point zero one percent on it. That's the, that's the only time you're not doing them, but look at your return, right? So you even to get the passive income, be looking to put in work to get going. But after it gets going, you have Ish and his team that's going to uh, partner with you and, and help you scale this. And possibly, like you said, there's an exit strategy that can be there at the end, right? So that's right, one opportunity. So right. right. So that's one opportunity. The, the other thing we talked about before we got into that, which is trucking um, the Hood Estates way. Uh, which is a passive way of doing trucking. Again, um, it's a way to get into trucking that doesn't require you to drive, dispatch, or handle any of the day-to-day -day operation. Uh, you can get in for about uh, ten to fifteen thousand. Some people have gotten in less, uh, depending on your credit. Uh, our courses are two ninety-seven, four ninety-seven, five ninety-seven. Um, you know, hit us up in the DM if you're interested in that. And again, whether you get the knowledge from me, from Ish. We don't care. We just we need to get this knowledge, put together some plans and start to execute as a community, as a people overall, because, um, you know, ain't nobody coming to save us. Right. We 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 got to do this. So uh, we owe it to ourselves. We owe it to our ancestors. We owe it to the future. You, you, you got a kid. You know, I have children like I have grandkids. So, you know, who, who else? Who, who else is going to to show Show them and leave leave we something for them. Right now. That's real. We gotta plant those seeds now. So y'all do that. Y'all go follow. Ish. It's always good having you, man. Like you know, I let you I let you watch the Laker game. Watch the playback of this, man. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Don't be not right about the haters. That's how you're supposed to treat them, man. You're supposed to squash them. You know what I'm saying? Hey. Don't let them don't let them breathe. <laughs> hey, it's all good, man. All right, all right bro. Go I'll let you, man. <laughs> <laughs> so listen, man. Um. We appreciate uh, Ish joining us tonight, man. Um, I hope y'all got some good information out of this. Hope everybody um, was able to take in something, and and hopefully it helps. You know, um, we got somebody here say, "Who wants to partner on a truck that's based in Atlanta? I have cash and good credit." There you go. See, there's opportunities. There's opportunities that are here all the time. Like I tell people, there's plenty of times that there's people uh, with plenty of opportunities that you can partner with and do things with, right? Hey, Vivia. So um, that's important. I also saw someone, and I'll, I'll touch on this really quick. I also saw someone mention something about self-driving trucks. So self-driving trucks, I'll touch on really quick. Um, again, we don't know. There's no exact date on when it will happen, if it will happen. I mean, I know they're working on things, but, you know, with, with, with safety issues and regulations, all that, God knows when. But what I can say with the Hood Estates model, it will not necessarily affect it other than your, if you're buying a self-driving truck, now you just, you don't have to get the driver. The, the truck does it, and, but it will be a lot more expensive. However, even with that, I still think if they came out with it in three, five, seven years, it, I, that's not something that's just going to, you know, automatically it just be done and over, right? It, that's going to take years, and I still don't think it'll ever be to a point where you don't have any real drivers out there on the road, right? Drivers are, are, the, are the backbone of the industry. And um, 
you know, I just don't think. But that's, again, my opinion. Now, here's the second thing I'll say about that. In the method that we do trucking, because the, 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 the entry amount is so low, you can literally have been made thousands or hundred thousands of dollars before this even happened. So I'm one of those people, you know, I get it, get in, and, you know, as they say, cross that bridge when we get there. By that time, I, I'm, I've made plenty of money, right? So that's, you know, that's my thoughts on it. Hood of States, Jamar in the house. Jihanna in the house. What's up? Our cybersecurity specialist. Y'all go check out Jihanna. If y'all ain't following her, she gonna get you right on your cybersecurity stuff. So, you know, that's what's up. Um, do you teach about strategies to find drivers in your course? So, yeah, we, we talk about, um, you know, different ways of how we finding drivers and stuff like that. But like I said in this live earlier, it's, it's just sometimes it's hit and miss, man. You know, people interview well, people nice resumes and you just don't know sometime until you get them in your truck and get them on the road outside of obviously background checks and you know things like that that the 3PL does anyway but you know it's like that so you know anyway but again um I appreciate y'all uh tapping in with us tonight and um you know I guess I'm about to go here I don't know where Sandy done went she done left somewhere but um I'm gonna I'm gonna jump off here and again man I I, I appreciate y'all so much love to y'all fam. Make sure y'all check us out. And y'all be safe out there. All right, fam. Peace.